San Francisco was terrorized in the late 60s and early 70s by a man who called himself the Zodiac Killer. He claimed 37 murders. Police confirmed at least six. Four years ago, the killing stopped, and so did Zodiac's letter. Now there's another letter. For that, Tom Shell. San Francisco police displayed a blackboard with excerpts of the latest Zodiac letter at a news conference last night. Police are convinced it's authentic. Deputy San Francisco Police Chief Clem D'Amica said it's the 16th letter received from the Zodiac Killer and the first since 1974. Letter number 16 has breathed new life into the investigation of at least six murders blamed on the Zodiac. Old files will be reviewed again. For the last nine years, the Zodiac investigation has been headed by homicide inspector David Tusky. I have always felt... Uh, yeah. A gut feeling that that he was not dead and that he was out there somewhere and that he would communicate. I, I was always hoping that we, he would communicate and, and not commit an act. A letter I can handle. The latest letter from the Zodiac poses more questions than it answers. Questions like, why has he only communicated twice in the past nine years? Has he killed in that time? No clues in the latest letter. But more importantly, who is the Zodiac and where is he? Tom Shell, ABC News, San Francisco.